Hey YouTube friends list and um YouTube subscribers and gosh I gotta do a different intro than this YouTube subscribers and viewers PS4 and PS5 friends list and players Rain Phoenix back again with a tutorial on how to install this Samsung 990 Pro with Heatsink M.2 SSD for the PS5. Without any further ado, here we go. Forgive my camera shakage. I don't have anything to prop my camera up with. Actually, I do. Give me a second. All right. Forgive me if this camera angle is a little off. I don't have proper. So you grab the PlayStation back here, right here, lift it, and it lifts right off. Let me get my tools here. Gotta have the right tool for the job. Gotta be prepared for anything. I wish I could install Dennis Rodman's voice from Double Team. This is, I don't know the screwdriver size, but this is the size you're going to need right there. Where's the SSD at? Oh, here it is. Take this off here. This is the first screw you take out of the dock bay, the bay door. <clears throat> and there's my panel. And now, gonna open this from the side, it looks like. And there's nothing else in the box. This is just some paperwork, I'm guessing. Yeah, just some paperwork and the SSD itself. Supposed to come with the heat sink, that's what it says. With heat sink. So I'm guessing that's it. Now, what you want to do is. There's a screw right there. So I'm gonna pause this video and take that screw out. So give me a minute. Okay, I got the SSD in. All I have to do is put this screw back in that little port hole there. I'm gonna pause this video and I'm gonna see it the next time you see my PS4, PS5, it'll be on the wall mounted back there and I'll be formatting it. So give me a second. All right, part three. Okay, I got the SSD in and it is running, firing on all cylinders here. Fired on all cylinders. Console storage is now a lot free. My M.2 is there. My PlayStation is okay. I need another, I need a hard drive for my PlayStation 4 games. But there's the SSD, and I like that it tells you the information right there. Samsung SSD 990 Pro with EC 2 terabytes. And I got 1.18 terabytes left. So that's pretty good there. Now I just got to get an external, a, a 2 terabyte hard drive for my PS2 games because yeah there's like five other games I want on here also what I would like is the ability to create folders on this screen right here instead of just being able to keep 10 games on here instead of just being able to keep 10 games on here I want to be able to put folders here instead of just being able to put a folder here 
and keeping them there because every time I put a folder here it tells me it rebuilds the database and when my database get rebuilt I end up having to freaking create the folder back that's kind of stupid but that is my tutorial of how to install an M.2 uh, this thing here Samsung M.2 um, SSD for your PS5 this is Rainy Phoenix signing out. You guys have fun and stay safe and stay scared.